is the night both sets of supporters have been waiting for. Not long now until kickoff on match day one in the Champions League. Who will get off to a positive start with all three points? Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. This is Derek Ray, joined for commentary by former England international Lee Dixon. And we're certainly in the mood for Champions League group stage action. It is Victoria Pilsen up against Juventus. Yeah, the long road to the final starts here in game one. Always think that if you win your home games and don't lose your away games, you've got a good chance of progressing. So hugely popular Juventus Lee from the north of Italy to the south, up and down the peninsula, and they look forward to the group stage of the Champions League every year. Well, they do. They're giants of world football, they really are, and I'm not going to mention how much I like their shirt. Absolutely brilliant shirt. Every kid should have one. But it's the tradition that goes with that shirt. They're serial winners. The initial 11 today for the hosts. Pretty well balanced this formation, Lee. Yeah, it can be a 4-2-3-1 in the offensive mode, but it can also go back to a 4-5-1 when you're defending. The lone striker will be supported by the three just behind him, especially the number 10 who will be given a free roll. And the old lady of Italian football going with this starting 11. Wojciech Szczesny starts in goal. Milo Lempianic plays alongside Sami Khedira in central midfield. And the main striker is the unmistakable Cristiano Ronaldo. And he's broken free. Can he beat the goalkeeper? And it's there for him. Well, just couldn't quite keep himself onside. The flag has gone up. It looked as though he might have been onside, but he was just a fraction off. Oh, I'm not so sure. I'd like to see that again. Meticulous polisher of his defensive game, Pjanic. And the goal belongs to the talented Paolo Dybala. Well, he drifts on the back of the defenders and then all of a sudden he's in. Well, let's see that again. Oh, it's so sweetly hit. Look at his technique. Absolutely brilliant. He's got the power, he's got the accuracy, and now he's got himself a goal. Underway again with Juventus in front. Patrick Kroszowski. Well, match day one in the UEFA Champions League, always exhilarating. And as we look at the group, what might we see in this section, Lee? Juventus always have to be considered amongst the favourites to win any competition. So much strength in depth, a tough team to break down, and we know they're capable of scoring their fair share of goals. Tottenham Hotspur are a joy to watch too, we know that, with their brand of football. So we'll just have to keep a close eye on this group to see how it progresses. Whatever it takes to keep them out, Crossing opportunity, not fantastic defending, let's see if it helps the opposition. Excellent challenge, and what a magical save it was! Corner coming up for Juventus. Pjanic firing it over, and you need your defender to take charge. And the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger. And giving the ball to the opposition that time. Douglas Costa! A very high degree of difficulty for any goalkeeper. Sheer quality. Quality of the shot and certainly quality of the save.
plenty of support. Cristiano Ronaldo. That's a splendid ball from Ronaldo. And Paulo Dybala is ready here. Just a bit too high with that powerful effort. Yeah, he's just leaned back, Derek. Power was there, but not the direction. Ronaldo wasteful in possession. And he's made headway. Does he have the beating of the goalkeeper? And the danger clear. Corner for Juve. And delivered by Pjanic. Oh, he's missed the chance to extend their advantage. Oh, a golden opportunity to really put the game to bed. Cristiano Ronaldo. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Well, that break looks so uh, promising, but nothing coming from it. Dybala. It's a weighted pass. Keeper's contribution. I'll tell you what, when the keeper looks lost as he was there, you've got to be ruthless. Well, big target, big chance, big flop. Costa with it. Just straying offside. Costa with it. Kadira. Pjanic now. Space galore for Juventus. Douglas Costa. Now, what can he do here? Tibala! Given away. And options in the centre. And no nonsense defensive clearance. Well, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. Well, if that goes in, Derek, this game would have a very different complexion about it. But as it stands, it still could go either way. And they deal with the threat this time. He's given it away. Good tackle. Alexandro now. Pjanic. Can he do it from... And a wild, wild attempt from long range. Not one for his highlight reel. Well, it's a poor choice. He's got other options on. Why is he shooting from that distance? Cristiano Ronaldo. Ronaldo threading it through. Douglas Costa! Another goal for the Bianconeri. Big moment for Juventus in this game. Well, let's see that again. Once he gets into his stride, he just strolls past players. What a lovely solo, wonderful effort this is. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. So, 2-0 now. Patrick Kroshovsky. Horjava. Kovarjik. Kermenchik has it. Good numerical situation. Job done, ball one. It's with Joao Cancelo. Now Quadrado. Excellent vision from Juan Quadrado. And he's broken free. Can he beat the goalkeeper? It has to be, surely. And Ronaldo with the goal. Brilliant, 
brilliant finish. Well, look at this, Derek. Sometimes the opposition are all set up perfectly for you to dribble through them. It's almost like he's playing FIFA. He goes through and puts the ball in the back of the net. It's brilliant. Well, you've got to say, an incredible first-half performance. That scoreline tells you all you need to know. Possibilities for Douglas Costa. Magrado might want it. Not really the ideal clearance. And now Douglas Costa. Well, regaining possession for his side cleverly. Kermenchik. through here only the keeper to beat and there it is the half-time whistle So the second half commences here. And it was one-way traffic in the first half. They're going to need all their time if they have designs on a comeback. Excellent challenge. Groszowski with it. Pjanic. And cleared away. They've given it away. Now Daniel Kolarz. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Eye-catching and effective in the first half. Paolo Dybala. Well, he's looked really sharp out there. Scored a goal, hit the woodwork, played really, really well. All going well for this man. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. And Ronaldo takes on the shot. Oh, that is a goal from long range. He won't soon forget. Absolutely right out of the top drawer. Let's have a look at this replay. Caught the keeper on his heels. And this is why. Short back lift, great strike, takes everybody by surprise. And the goal that was scored, well worth another look, Lee. Well, sadly, we have to conclude that this hasn't really been a contest, but all credit to any side committed to scoring goals like this. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Well, they did have possession of the ball, but all that good work now counts for nothing. Pjanic. That's a splendid ball from Ronaldo. And can he make this move count? Paolo Dybala waiting. Well, it makes a pretty picture for those photographers behind the goal, but I'm not sure he was ever going to score with that bicycle kick. Well, overhead kick looks good. Not really the option, though. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. Cristiano Ronaldo. Ronaldo threading it through. Douglas Costa. He's in behind. Off the post and back in play. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. Juventus, the old lady, they know how to keep the ball. 
What can they do from here? Opportunity it is. And the ball is in the net. The crowd have gone crazy, and quite rightly so. What a finish that is. Well, I'm sure you want to see this again. Where is everybody? The defenders, nowhere to be seen, is an open goal. Well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. Well, it has been one-sided, but they deserve the plaudits for the fact that they've kept going and going. It's all about translating threats into goals. Let's see what they can do here. Haida. Just wanted to get it out of there. Joao Cancelo. Kadira. Abrado. And here's Blaise Matuidi. A Juventus corner forthcoming. Corner kick played over. And the danger clear. And the defender takes care of business. So, 20 minutes to go. Well, he's got plenty of space on the flank here. Emre Can. Now, Quadrado. Dybala. Well, body in the way. And that's a corner. Paolo Dybala with the corner. But didn't quite do enough. Fine reaction save from the goalkeeper. Goalkeeping at its best. Really, really top draw. He's driven in the corner. And Cristiano Ronaldo bags a goal. Well, how do you stop him? You put one on, he beats one. Put two on him, he beats two. Well, quite a lot of the time you need good movement to get away from your marker, but you also need brilliant, brilliant delivery. And this is as good as it gets. What a header. There has been a gulf in quality tonight, but you've really got to give them credit for the fact that they haven't let up at all. Haida. And on the ball, Orjava. My oh, goodness, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. Excellent vision from Juan Cuadrado. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. It looked as though he was going to score, but last-ditch defending is something you know about, Lee. Yeah, he was hassled. It made him hurry his shot, and it's close. Well, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. been given away here by Ronaldo Patrick Kroshovsky Limbersky with it Emre Can and Cuadrado in full control of the ball here and it might be Douglas Costa just a bit too high with that powerful effort. Yeah, he's just leaned back, Derek. Power was there, but not the direction. Well, 
he's given it away. Considerable momentum, courtesy of Ronaldo. But what can he produce from here? Quadrado, the Colombian, cuts from so far away. It didn't appear to be the high percentage option. Close, though. Well, he surprised everybody, including me. Long-range effort, and it wasn't too far off, was it? Well, on the second half here, and it's almost, Lee, a case of... Whatever they've touched has turned to goals. Well, we all know creating and scoring goals is the hardest thing to do in football. But Juve have ticked all the boxes in that department for me. They've been absolutely amazing. Lovely to watch too. And the players look like they're enjoying it. All got smiles on their faces. And on the basis of that effort, quite clearly, he's not wearing his shooting boots at the moment. Well, it was a strong effort. Used his laces, but uh, screwed it well off target. Kermenchik. Federico Bernardeschi. Ronaldo feeds it. Quadrado might be able to take it to the bank. Oh, it was a crucial challenge. Kolash. They've given it away. And now Ronaldo. It's a weighted pass. And that's what the Bianco Nelly a goal for Juventus. The crowd have gone crazy, and quite rightly so. What a finish that is. Well, it's not a brilliant goal, but it's a goal. It's in the back of the net. Keeper couldn't do anything about it. And the goal that was scored, well worth another look, Lee. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. This game is in the history books, and Juventus have claimed all three points from their opening game of the Champions League season. Yeah, really, really strong start. That's what you need. But with five games to go, very important you stay in the now. One game at a time, Derek. Bit of a cliche.